Okay, so we're going to be installing this armrest into the polo. So I'm going to assemble the armrest outside of the polo and then put it in. So this is everything that comes with it. You've got the main armrest console. You've got this little plastic trim. You've got two metal brackets, this one and this one. And the provided screws with it as well. So to start this off, you're going to want to grab one of these silver screws and these two pieces and with it facing like this so you see this has a like a jaggedy line here you want to get the jaggedy line on this piece as well and then put those together there and then at the back here you want to put the screw through here all right so you want to put the screw into the back of here there are two different types of screws though so you have this type and then you have the one that just looks flat at the top so you want to use this one that just looks flat at the top to screw into the back of this all right i've screwed that in as you can see it there this is solid just like that then you want to go to your actual armrest as you can see there's another metal piece in here so you want to grab the piece that you just put together and then have it so that this bit like as you can let me try to get that into frame there's one long bit here this will be sticking out the back of the armrest so it will be pointing this way so you're just gonna place it in there like this over the other piece of metal inside the armrest here there's a little plastic tab right here which is blocking me from putting the support down in here so I'm just gonna bend this and break it I'm just folding it from side to side to get it loose There we go. I've broken it off. There it is. So now, this middle bracket should be able to slide in there. And it does. Now there's a hole at the bottom of that bracket there. Where you want to grab the other screw that looks flat. And then put that in there and screw it in. Okay, now that that's been screwed in. So as you can see right there, the screw's in. The assembly of the armrest is now complete. It should look like this. So that long part pointing out the back of the armrest. So this is the back and everything together. And you should have three screws left. So you have a black screw, it looks like this. And then you have the two other style screws right there. So now I'm going to head to the car and then show you how to bolt it into the car. We're in the polo, we're in the back seat. To start off, you're going to want to remove the cup holder. This is really easy. You can literally just put your fingers underneath here, pry it up a bit and literally just lift up. Yeah. <laughs> all right there we go got my hand out of it now so cup holders out as easy as that just pull it out it's got quite a lot of clips as you can see but you won't break anything and you won't be needing that anymore so in here you'll see you have one screw here so you have that screw and under this little flap of carpet you'll see a hole there and under this little flap of carpet here you will see another hole and those are all the holes you're going to need to put in the armrest so you're going to want to start off by removing the black screw that's at the back and that's going to be a t20 torx bit and that is this one right here Okay, 
okay that screw is now out just so you know you're not going to be using this screw again because in the package it comes with this one and you're going to be replacing it with this one you can see it's slightly longer because it has to go through the bracket but this is what you're going to replace it with so you can put that screw away as we're not going to need it and then you can take your actual armrest and just work its way into this gap which might be a task drop in the right side push it back move this forward okay well we've got it in there so that's a good start now I just need to get the metal underneath the carpet bit oh, this is so hard to do with my camera in the way so all I'm doing is I'm trying to get these metal clips but the ones on the side underneath the little bit of carpet that flaps over here so I'm just gonna put this under the carpet and then I'll cut back to when I'm screwing it in as you're not going to be missing much and you can't really see it properly on the camera anyway this is now underneath the carpet and it's sitting flush around this edge bit here so I'm going to put in the black screw that goes at the back here. But I'm not going to screw it all the way in. I'm just going to have it screwed in a bit, but just keep it loose so that I can still work with the other two at the side. So I've got the new black screw here. I'm just going to put it in. Just going to give it a few turns so it's in there but it's still loose and now i'm going to grab one of the silver ones and i'm going to try squeeze it in here there's a very tight gap actually this is going to be quite tedious to do i may have to do this bit off camera as well but all it is is screwing this screw into the hole down there that I showed you earlier and then put in the other screw just like this into the hole on this side that I also showed earlier so I'm just going to screw these in and then I'll cut back again okay so all three screws are in you see the one on the right there the one on the left the lighting isn't that great but you can see it in there to the left and the one at the back here so all those are in as you can see this thing is sturdy it's not going anywhere I can't lie though getting to getting those screws in and tightened down that was a tedious task because the angle at which these are at is so weird with this being in the way and everything it was hard to get the screws in there to put in there and it was just hard to screw them in as well so bear that in mind if this is something that you're going to do yourself that was a very tedious task that i did not have fun doing but it's in there now and i'm happy this is the final piece you just put this on top like this let's make sure everything is going in correctly there we go and just press down on this piece And there you have it the armrest installation is complete this one looks OEM this is like the OEM style um, armrest so it's secure it looks the part in the car you can bring it up like this you press this in bring it back down it's obviously got the little storage compartment here you can store stuff in now it's really nice i'm going to get some angles of it from the front as well so you can see it but from the back it's all done i'm gonna to go to the front show you it from the front okay here's the armrest from the front 
as you can see much more OEM it looks the part in the car it's in here goes up press the button comes down click this up storage sturdy not more you can really ask for to be honest so that was the video hopefully you liked this video uh, a link will be in the description to where you can buy this if you want to pick one up yourself so yeah that's the video if you liked like share subscribe do all that stuff and till next time peace